Hey. Please, 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 please. No. I need to catch him. Oh my god, that is horrifying. Blood right there. Soothe, 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 please. Please, please. Yes. Oh my god. I got the golden horse. Okay. Okay. So. I need to find a... Oh my god, I'm actually kind of horrified. I don't want to lose this horse. I need to find... I need to find a... Oh god. I need to find the nearest... A, a farm hut. I, I need it. Oh my god, he is so huge and horrifying. I don't want to fight him. Oh my god, just seeing him fly across this guy is horrifying. Okay. What is this, though? What is this? Hold on. <gasps> whoa, 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 whoa. It's a f this is a fairy fountain. Away with you. I don't want anything to do with a world ruined by gloom and ruled by monsters. It's cramped in my flower bud, but better than out there. I'll keep my blessings of clothing enchantments to myself. So I'll hear the sound of a horn bringing some lively music into the world. I'll never go outside again. Let me to be, uh, to be near a stable or near enough and anyway, so I could grace travels with my blessings. But now until I hear the sound of a horn, wait. So there is one nearby. Is that it? It is. Oh, okay. That's our next destination. Yeah. Listen, I'm supposed to be investigating ruins and sky islands around here, but I can't go near the North LeMay Labyrinth because of the gloom. And I can't get near the Typhlo ruins because of weird animatons, so I really can't investigate anything. It's demoralizing. Talking about it does make me feel a little better, though. Thanks for listening. I have advice, but it's mostly just kind of... You could get somebody to defend you, hire a, a, a defender, or... This one's not as nice. You could just kind of man up and go in. Although it's dangerous. You're putting your life on the line. I don't suggest that recommendation. <laughs> I'm just saying. Find an enemy on a fucking horse. No? What was that? You saw that, right? The game froze. What in the hell? I miss music. Yeah. Thanks for coming in such a bad weather. Oh. Welcome, welcome. You reached Snowfield oh. Stable. Thank you for supporting the Stable Association. Uh. Okay, now then, once again, wait. Link, that horse. Oh. Isn't that the golden horse that ran away from our stable? Oh, is it? What to say? Thank you so much for bringing it back here. But Harlow was the one looking after the horse, so am I bringing it to her? She should be around back. Oh. She's been so worried ever since the poor thing ran away. Please go put her mind at ease. Ooh. Anything else? I hope the horse is safe. Oh. Ah. Your story is really something. Mind going through it again? Just to make uh, sure I have all the details right? Uh. Well, actually, our beloved missing Princess Zelda showed up at the stable here the other day. It was strange. The sight of her really agitated the princess's golden horse. Which we keep stable there. Wait, the sight of her really agitated the princess's golden horse? Mm. The steed started acting wild like it was terrified for its life. The poor creature bolted and I haven't seen it since. Wait, your horse has a golden coat just like hers. Oh. It can't be. It must be. That's the princess's golden horse which has been missing for quite some time. The horse sick. And now here you've brought the horse back. Oh, partner! I barely got my beak into the situation here and you just roll in with the horse? That kind of throws me off the saddle here in the middle of an interview. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, just giving you a hard time. Besides, these good deeds of yours just feather my reputation. You make me proud. But, huh, is it just me or has that horse gotten kind of attached to you? <sighs> I know this horse well and I do believe you're right. What's strange is that when Princess Zelda appeared here, this gentle creature ran off in a frenzy, as if terrified. But for some reason, the princess's horse really does seem to trust you. Mm -hmm. Now that I think about it, 
I can't believe that horse ran away at the... I can't believe that horse ran away at the side of Princess Zelda. Could it be that wasn't the princess? I know her face anywhere, but it was snowing hard. Maybe I have it wrong. Really, you'd be doing me a favor if you kept this gentle creature. Princess Zelda asked me to find someone who'd take good care of it. <laughs> and in your travels around Hyrule, perhaps you'll even have a chance to reunite this horse with the princess. <laughs> If that's the case, partner, then how could you say no to keeping it? Do it as a favor for the horse, at least. Wait, I want you to have this, too. Royal Brittle. Well known for being a favorite of the Hyrulean royal, royal family. Its gold ornaments leave an impression, but its true value lies in its solid craftsmanship. Also, please take this. The Royal Saddle. This is emblem design of this saddle. It's something that the Princess Zelda held herself. Okay. The bridle and the saddle left behind by Princess Zelda. The little ones are accustomed to those, so feel free to use them. Also, take this with you. Damn. Thank you. Oh. I thought uh, of using this energy elixir if I had to help on the horse after it bolted off, but I don't need that anymore, so I'll give it to you. Ah. You might still be a rookie, but you're every bit of a good reporter as I thought you'd be. Thanks to you, I'll have the full story when I write my oracle. We work together to chase two of the stories relating to Princess Zelda. Go on, add this to your nest, egg partner. Thank you. Oh, there's also this. It's from Tracy. Lucky Clover Gazette fabric. Tough fabric but bearing a Lucky Clover Gazette design. It looks like it could be used to make a paragon. Oh! So Hatena Village's dye shop in Nakluda has started up a new service. It has something to do with fabrics. I know, I know. I'm basically giving you an extra job by handing over the, this fabric, but still. The point is that by accepting and making use of it, you can show that you're officially part of the Lucky Clover Gazette. Mm. It would be nice if Tracy handled things a bit more simply, though. Anyway, that's all done. It's always great working with your partner. <laughs> Alright, I'm off to the office to write up this whole piece of the for the paper. Take care, partner. Let's work together again soon. So long! I guess I'm keeping this horse now. You sure it was sure? Yes. Oh. Got it. Refree, uh, yes. Oh. Oh. As you're registering a new horse, we'll add another points. And I can get a new reward. First, please name name of your horse. Okay. Oh. Oh. Alright, alright, alright. And then here. Receive reward. Hi. Ah, yes, I'll be right with you. Oh. You like to get your pony points reward, oh. right? Provide points, you get the horse god fabric. The horse god fabric. Top fabric being a design of the horse god Melania. It looks like it could be used to make a paraglider. Oh. I hear the dye shop in Hatena Village has a new service using fabric. If you ever find yourself in the Kluda, you ought to stop by. I'm sure they can help put this fabric to use. Uh, if you save up just two Aww. points, you'll be able to use the Melania bed, which is said to bring prophecies from the horse called Melania. Appreciate your patronage. Oh, oh Link, don't you afraid you caught your eye? What is it? Oh. Stable Association has decided we stable owners should display pictures on the well, on the guests. To start by hanging up frames. Yep, you'll find frames like this one here on stable walls across mm. the land. Putting a lot of thought into what might be a good painting to pair with the frame. And I've finally made my decision. I want a picture of the giant bird with wings spread wide in the Heber Mountains. Oh. Tell me, have you seen the Lone Sadar tree growing on Talanto Peak, the uh, southernmost Heber Mountain? If you look to the northwest from the tree on a clear day, you can see the form of a giant bird on the mountainside. Mm. I've never seen the real thing, though. I'd go if I could, but there's no way I can leave the stable unattended. <laughs> but how magnificent it, it must be, thinking of that giant bird stretching its wings in the Hebrew Mountains gives me chills. How I wish I could put its likeness on the wall. Even copying it from a dis decent picture would be enough for me. Mm. Speaking of pictures, there's this re researcher at Lookout Landing named Robbie. He was saying that that ha he has a thing called a camera. In po oh, wait. Oh. Oh, I, so I have to go back to the, to, to the, to the main area. I'll sleep here, and we will end the video here, because, yeah, so...
Uh, good morning, did you sleep well? Yes, I did, thank you. As thanks for logging us, we get another point. Thank you, thank you. Oh. I'm back again. Okay. And with that, we'll end the video here. And I'll see you guys in the next video. If you liked this video, if you like this video, oh, cute doggy. If you like this video, if you like this video, hit that thumbs up button. If you have something to say, don't forget to leave a smile in the comments below. And show your support by hitting that subscribe button. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video.